Hey, uh, I'm early. Yeah, yeah. I don't write and get suspended or anything. It was just a half day. Good. Did you see Lulu this morning? Yeah, for a second when I came in to grab my book. How does she seem? In a hurry? Huh. Why are you guys getting a fight? Uh, uh, not exactly. Do you want to talk about it? No. Okay. I, I lied to her. Okay, about, about what? Brenda. Let me guess you lied to Lulu by saying you weren't in danger guarding Brenda? Well, it's, a, it's a little more complicated than that. Okay. Maybe I can help you sort it out if you explain to me what's, you know, going on. Right. This, this is my problem. I don't want to drag you down with the stuff. Look, you've helped me out in a lot of ways. Really, you have. you not just with Judge Carroll, but I would have got kicked out of Madison if it wasn't for you. Look, I want to start repaying the favor. Look, you don't owe me anything, Michael. <sighs> Look, I get growing up, you only had your mom to count on, but you've got a family now. Me, Morgan, Christina. We all help each other out. That's the way, you know, brothers and sisters work. So come on. Right, when Jason brought Brenda back from Rome, I pretended like I didn't know her. When I did, I met her a few years earlier in Manhattan. I guarded her for two weeks. Okay. But it doesn't sound so bad. No, but Lulu found out and then asked me why I didn't tell her about it, and I just told her that Brenda probably wouldn't remember me anyway and that I was just a... A cop assigned to guard a door, which is also a lie. I was more than that. How much more? Brennan and I got pretty close. Not bad about lying to Lulu, but it's not like you had much of a choice. No, I did have a choice. I could have told her about it as soon as I found out Brenda was in town. Okay, I'm, I'm pretty sure telling Lulu he had a fling with a supermodel would have cost a much bigger fight. I was, she was going through a lot. I just, I was, I was helping her. But I ended up blurring the line of where my job was and, and what I felt was right. Okay, if that's all it was, then why lie to Lulu? No, I can't go into the details, but I lied. I was certain it'd be better if I just said that Brenda and I never met. Looks like Christmas came early. Dad's welcome papers. I'll let you do the honors. Or, or I could accidentally uh, spill coffee all over them, you know, slow things down a bit. Well, I guess you should have got a warrant to screen the wiretap. Yeah, well, it doesn't change what was on that tape, okay? Sonny confirmed that he had Johnny Zakara's car rigged to blow, and it almost killed your sister. And now we're cutting them loose. Does that sound like justice to you? No, but if you want the charges to stick against Sonny, you gotta go by the book. Yeah, like that's even possible with you and Claire bending over backwards to keep Sonny from getting what he deserves here. Hey, hey. I need to ask you a favor. Well, I guess it all depends on what the favor is. Claire's being investigated by the Internal Affairs. Is there... Can you talk to anyone? What makes you think anyone's going to listen to what I have You're to say? You're a cop. You got more integrity than anybody in this whole department. Yeah, and I'm also your son, which means that I'm just as compromised as Claire's. This internal affairs investigation, how, how bad is it going to get? Well, she got herself taken out the case due to conflict of interest, and then she declared a key piece of evidence inadmissible. They're going to make an example out of her. Her career? Well, she's done as a prosecutor. I mean, she might even be facing charges if they can prove that, that she accepted gifts or favors from you. This, you know, this whole thing with Claire started out is just a, a challenge. We, we agree that we we're going to stop playing games and we were going to get real, but she, we were both consenting adults. She, she could deal with the fallout. I had no idea it was going to end like this for her. This is one of the first things you learn about law enforcement. You stay detached. The minute you get personal, you start bending rules. It seems like a good idea at the time. You know, you're going to face the consequences later on. See, uh, your driver will take you to the airport. 
He saved me. I was just doing my job. Yeah, I don't know why you helped me, but thank you. You're, uh, you're gonna miss your plane? Yeah. Should, uh, should call Brenda, let her know you're down here. Why? She needs to see you. 